what's up YouTube? How's it going? Did you guys know that if two identical twin women marry and have kids with two identical twin men, their kids is genetically siblings? Huh. So my last video asked you guys, when's your birthday? And this is what you said. Today's question of the day is, if you had one wish, what would it be? Okay, so let's talk about Britain's fattest man. Keith Martin, he weighs 70 stones. Or for people like me, this guy weighs 980 pounds. He has been bed bound for the last two years. And for the past year, this guy can't even sit up on his bed. This guy hasn't left his home for the past 10 years. That's insane and just so sad. It actually costs 66,000 a year to take care of Keith. A team of surgeons, doctors, and nurses have taken an epic task trying to save this guy's life. He's only 43 years old and we're already talking about his death. His body mass index is 155. A healthy range is 18.5 to 24.9. Doctors are giving this guy only two years to live. He has been in a video documentary and he recently just watched it and he realized that, wow, am I really that big? So now that he knows and how unhealthy it is, he wants to make a life change. Let's just hope that it's not too late for Keith. So right now he's living with his sisters, Tina and Sharon. They are full-time caretakers for their brother. Keith started to pile on his weight after the loss of his mother. When she passed away, he felt that it was all his fault because his mother wasn't healthy and instead of going to the hospital, well, she stayed home to take care of him. In one day, Keith would actually consume around 10,000 calories. That is insane. An average person is only 2,000. So he's consuming a week's worth of calories in just one day. His meals would include for breakfast, 24 fried eggs. Like seriously, how about we, uh, we just don't give this guy all this food? But I don't know, that's just me. What do you guys think about this whole thing? So Candace Armstrong is 28 years old and she became a bodybuilder. After all these years of using steroids, it slowly turned her into a man. She no longer has female attributes. Instead, she has facial hair growing all over her face and armpit hair. Wait, girls, girls grow that stuff, right? She has a deep voice and a killer body. Holy crap, like this is insane. I would so use Candace as a personal trainer. So just like Keith, she was also featured in a documentary that aired on TLC. She said that she never wants to stop taking these drugs because it has improved her life. She can probably be casted as the Hulk. Imagine dating her, she would definitely be the man of the relationship. And you wouldn't want to piss her off. There would be like no arguments ever. Jodie Marsh was also in a documentary as a champion bodybuilder, but she has never used steroids. So she did all of this without drugs, so it's very possible to become a bodybuilder and not take steroids. And of course, you don't have to lose any of your female traits. Anyways, viewers, that was your today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed that and all the news, and I'll see you guys in the next video.